Here's something Fox News absolutely does not want you to see. Watch this clip. At what point did Mr. Giuliani begin working directly with Russian agents and Russian assets, individuals who would later become sanctioned by Donald Trump's own Treasury Department for spreading propaganda and disinformation against Joe Biden? Uh, it was sometime in uh, probably around May, June of 2019. Were you aware, was Mr. Giuliani aware that these people were basically just doing the bidding of Vladimir Putin? Absolutely. So he had no hesitation about spreading lies that were concocted by Russian agents? As long as it fit the narrative, absolutely not. How were you and Giuliani able to take these false allegations peddled by corrupt officials and Russian agents and promote and amplify them here in the United States in our political system? Weren't media groups skeptical of your claims? Um, most media groups, uh, I'd probably say all except for Fox and a few other uh, right-wing media groups uh, didn't want to take any of the information and that ag uh, aggravated uh, Rudy Giuliani and John Solomon and other players. And the main group that was being pushed through was Fox, uh, Sean Hannity, and some other media personnel over there. But then there was also other people that were doing the bidding for the Russian uh, people in Congress, like Senator Ron Johnson, like Congressman Pete Sessions that sits here right now that was with me from the very beginning on this journey into finding up the digging dirt on Joe Biden. So a little bit of context here. This is during the sham impeachment that Republicans are putting forward in search of dirt of Joe Biden. Normally impeachments are supposed to take place when a president has done something wrong. This Republican impeachment is taking place in search of wrongdoing. Totally backwards. But this is Lev Parnas. Lev Parnas is Rudy Giuliani's old business partner who was tasked to find dirt on Joe Biden. And so this impeachment hearing has really backfired on Republicans because here's Lev Parnas who knows Rudy Giuliani very well and he essentially says that giuliani trump and fox news were all doing the bidding of russia and worse than that giuliani knew that they were doing the bidding of vladimir putin so between this and donald trump's constant praise of vladimir putin and russia and republicans and trump's complete unwillingness to help Ukraine makes me makes me have to ask what does Russia have on Trump and what does Trump have on Republicans that this is taking place America first is a sham it's Russia first